The fact that we need a strong foundation when we follow the instruction of the Quran difference in halal and haram. How we apply Islam in terms of the life we are leading today. I'm applying it in my daily life and that makes me a better Muslim. We need guidance. We should thank Allah SWT for the Quran. We have the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him as a human example. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Raising children in any society, in any place or time is a challenge for all parents. But raising children in a society where Muslims and the Islamic ideas are a minority view is a much more difficult task. It is fair to say that we all want our children to grow up to be safe, to be protected and to be healthy. But we do also want them to be obedient to us, to be respectful to the elders, to be proactive in the ibadah, to be motivated and involved in the communities and to be confident in their deen. To be able to nurture such complete and holistic Islamic personalities means that we as parents have to provide our children with a complete and holistic program of tarbiyah. Their memorization of the articles of faith need to be complemented with the proof of Allah's existence and the arguments that refute evolution and other such nonsense. Their reading of the Quran needs to be complemented with the proof that this Quran is the only truth from our Creator and it is a complete guidance for the whole of mankind. The reading of their daily salahs needs to be complemented with making their character upright to shun them from the rotten values that exist in today's society and ground them firmly in the best of values of Islam. It helps me build up my confidence. I am learning the deen of Islam. It made me think and question challenging tasks that help us think more about our religion. We learned things about being well-mannered, how to make friends and what to do in life. The sessions were such fun. We did different activities. I really enjoy these 24 hour challenges. My dear brothers and sisters, my fellow parents, what I have learned over the last many months through preparing and delivering a tarbiya program for the youth and through my engagement and interaction with many parents is that there is a space to create a parent support resource. A parent support resource that can become a tool for any and all parents, inshallah, which they can use in their own personal journey of parenthood. I am hopeful that together with my team, we are able to produce some regular content which can be delivered through social media and hopefully can reach as many parents as possible. Content such as short videos, presentations, tasks and worksheets that can be completed by parents and children working together. Everything that will inshallah help build and develop a loving and caring relationship within the household. What an amazing vision if it can be achieved by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. They make things easy to understand with, with excellent fun activities. Why should other kids join this, this Tarbiya group? They should join it because so that they can learn more about Islam. My dear brothers and sisters, I ask you all to support this project. Not only to use this content, but also to share and forward to your family and friends. Each and every parent will say the same thing as I say today, that every parent shares the same goal vision and aspiration for their children. What we wish for more than anything else is to be able to do our utmost to nurture our children around Islam and that we are able to carve out a path for them that will ultimately lead them to Jannah. I urge you all to follow us using the links below and let's begin the project of leading the Muslims towards Jannah. Wa alaykum as wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Rabbi, 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 Rabbi,